What's up guys, welcome back. You're watching part two of my Silent Night gaming PC mini-series, if you will, uh, where in part one we actually built a system that's really tailored for acoustic magic. Uh, it's supposed to be as quiet as we could possibly make it, and I even gave you a taste in part one of how quiet it was, granted, at idling, uh, even though you, you, the, the camera was inside of the computer, you guys were also hearing it through the, the crappy point, my point-and-shoots built-in mic, which isn't very great. Um, but uh, we're actually going to do a proper acoustics test this time around with my fancy pants Sennheiser microphone. And last but not least, we're going to take a look at thermals, because no matter how quiet the system is, it doesn't really matter if things are overheating and shutting down uh, or, or frying, God forbid. Uh, so we're going to be taking a look at all that, starting with the acoustics test. But what if I told you that you're already listening to the system under load right now from within the computer. Yes, that's right. You have been inside of the computer this whole time, and it has been actually running the Metro, Light, Metro Last Light benchmark since the beginning of this video. So, um, yeah, you guys probably heard a little bit of buzzing, maybe some electrons firing in there, but let me get you out of here. It's probably a little uncomfortable. Here's a look of the system that you were just in. You ever been inside of a computer? Like, like that much inside of a computer? Probably not, right? And here's a Metro Last Light, pumping away. So obviously you guys might have been hearing a little bit of fan noise or buzzing since the start of the video, but probably not convinced that you were actually inside of a case. Uh, it's just a clear indication of how quite- Shut that dog up! This is a, a great indication of what's to come with our official acoustics test, so why don't we get that started right now. All right, not too shabby, eh? Uh, so yeah, you can see this is clearly a really, really quiet system. You probably heard a little bit, a little bit of noise, but you probably heard the traffic out my, outside my window even more than the actual system under load. Uh, so that's really awesome. Uh, I probably should have also started this video off with my testing methodology before jumping into the acoustics test, but you know how I do. So why don't we just go ahead and go over this really quick. I did dial in a, a moderate overclock on the 960, got 120 megahertz boost uh, for the, uh, the, the core clock. And then we've got a 50 megahertz boost, a smaller one for the memory. Uh, so the total, we've got about, we, we hit 1486 megahertz at our maximum clock speed. Uh, and uh, we, we did dial in, oh, I didn't dial in, but MSI dialed in its automatic overclock using their, their handy dandy gaming app. Uh, obviously a really modest overclock. We could have pushed it further, tweaked the voltage a little bit and done some more things. But I just wanted to give a really quick uh, example here. So 4100 megahertz ain't too shabby. Um, and uh, why don't we take a look at the temps? Why don't we take a look at the temps? This is this is where it's at, folks. So you can see right here, 6600K, Core i5, we got our four cores. And the hottest we got was 64 degrees Celsius, and that's on, only on the hottest core. Average, average we're looking at, you know, anywhere from 57 to 58 degrees Celsius, which isn't too bad for a, for a semi-passive, you know, uh, CPU cooler without any attached fan. So that's actually really good. Uh, and then the GPU, the Twin Frozer 5 cooler on the 960 from MSI is actually really good at, at uh, keeping uh, thermals down to a minimum. So 67 degrees Celsius there, and that was with the side panel on. Uh, made sure to do testing uh, that way. So overall, this has been a success. I would call this a success. What do you guys think? Do you think, uh, do you think the silence you think the, the maybe slightly higher temperatures from from you know so few fans and limited cooling in the case might might cost you a little bit uh, of degrees there but overall do you think it's worth having that silent that silent operation for a few degrees of heat i do want to hear from you guys so leave some feedback down in the comment section below and i will be sure to check all of them out uh and thanks for watching uh toss me a like on the video if you enjoyed it feels free blah, 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 blah. feel free to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already i love you all have a very merry christmas well, actually, if you're watching this, Christmas is already over, so have a very happy new year, and make sure you're safe, don't drink and drive, call a frickin' cab or Uber, whatever, um, and have fun. Have fun, but be safe. I don't want any of you, you know, showing up dead on Twitter or something like that the following day. Uh, but that's really morbid to think about. But thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys really soon in the next video. Take care. I love ya. I love ya. Bye.